Hey YouTube, Tom here from Case and Glory Football Cards. Um, I'm making a video response to Tommy Goff's um, contest. Uh, he was asking for us to do a video showing our top five favorite cards. Um, and it's funny because I've actually been wanting to do a video um, that showcases like my top ten cards. So uh, his contest kind of gave me an excuse to make this video. Um, so I'm going to show my top ten and then Tommy Goff, uh, the top five will, will actually be the, uh, the entries for your contest. Um, I know I'm also supposed to give you a, a number, one through five, um, for one of your, your grand prizes. I'm going to go with number four. If I do end up winning, uh, I'll go with number four. Um, but anyway, let me get started here. I'm going to go through my top ten cards, um, starting off with number ten. Number three of 15 actually the patch version um, Cleveland Browns great Jim Brown um, held the NFL all-time rushing record for a lot of years before uh, Walter Payton came along and broke it um, beautiful autograph on this card um, again this is from 2006 Leaf Limited um, the Limited Legends set so Jim Brown will go out at number 10 um, number nine, I actually pulled this card myself, um, so it kind of has some sentimental value to it. Um, number two of five, the numbering's hard to see, but uh, another Hall of Fame, Chicago's Bears great, Gale Sayers. This is from a 2011 gold standard. Um, it's actually a prime patch there, single color, but a prime patch autograph, Gale Sayers, numbered out of five. So I guess that would be number nine. Number eight, I actually uh, made in a trade off of YouTube uh, with Mr. Red Raider 20. He hasn't been on as much, uh, Dave, but uh, I actually made a, a few deals with him uh, when he was really doing the YouTube thing. This card, numbered one out of ten from 2000 and I believe it was 2010 National Tre or two, yeah 2010 National Treasures uh, Colossal Jumbo Jersey Number Autograph. Of Adrian Peterson. This was my first Adrian Peterson autograph. Um, I had to give him a bunch of stuff to get this, uh, but it's kind of cool. It'll always have a, a special spot in my collection, being my first AP auto. So AP will go down at number eight. Uh, moving on, number seven. I also pulled this card um, last year, I guess, last spring. So another one that has some uh, some nice sentimental value to it. Number 13 of 15 from 2010 Tops Tribute, the gold parallel dual jersey autograph of Peyton Manning. Um, I did have a couple uh, Peyton Manning autos prior to this, but uh, this was the first Manning auto that I pulled. Number 3 of 15 down there in the corner by his pant leg. So again, like, was really happy to get this one. Um, so Peyton will go down at number 7. Uh, number 6. I actually got this card off of eBay um, prior to him being named Comeback Player of the Year and just having an outstanding season. But uh, from 2009, SP Authentic, uh, numbered at a 4.99, a Matthew Stafford rookie card, beautiful on-card autograph, three-color patch. Definitely one of my favorite cards. Um, and hopefully this guy has plenty more great years to come. Um, I really liked him coming out of college. That's why I wanted to pick up some of his stuff. So, the Matthew Stafford will go down in six. Uh, so, moving on to my top five. Naturally, I'm a Giants fan. And uh, this guy, two-time Super Bowl MVP. Uh, so, of course, this card's got to be my top five. Uh, 2004 Ultimate Collection. Base rookie auto of Eli Manning. Just a beautiful, huge on-card autograph. Um... And that one's numbered at a 150. So Eli will take the five spot. Moving on, my favorite running back of all time. Um, this is another card I got uh, as an eBay pickup from 2009 Exquisite, numbered four of 20. The man himself, Barry Sanders. Beautiful on-card autograph again. This is from the uh, signature jersey collection. From 09 Exquisite. I love the look of these cards. And uh, to be able to pick up a Barry Sanders in it, it was just awesome. So I couldn't pass up the opportunity. So Barry taking the four spot. Uh, moving on to the top three. 
This card uh, I wanted ever since I started collecting football cards uh, back in 1996. I think I was like 12 years old at the time. Uh, I finally got it over the winter. Um, my local card shop had it, and the owner over there uh, gave me a really good deal on it. So I had to take it kind of like as a Christmas present for myself. But a 1976 Tops Walter Payton rookie card. In really nice condition. Uh, I think it had a little a little ding on the bottom right-hand corner there, but nothing bad at all. Um, just Walter Payton. Don't need to say anything else. But uh, Payton, that'll be my number three favorite, I guess. Um, moving on to number two. One of, uh, I guess, my first Hall of Fame autos from 2009 National Treasures. Um, I think this was 2009. I'm going to say 2009 National Treasures. Two-time Super Bowl champion, Hall of Famer, John Elway. Three-color patch autograph, um, the Century Collection set. That is just an unreal card. Uh, numbered on the back, two of seven. I found this one night on eBay. Um, I believe the seller listed it wrong because it didn't look like there's too many bids on it or uh, too many people watching it. And I feel like I absolutely stole this card on eBay and definitely one of the favorites in my collection. So John Elway will take the number two spot. And then I, I would have to say my number one card favorite card um, there wasn't too many autographs of this guy his rookie year uh, extremely tough to come by as any collector would know but uh, from 2000 and Fle 2000 Fleer Autographics uh, not numbered but short printed nonetheless a Tom Brady rookie autograph on card auto um, in his Michigan Wolverines uniform but I would have to say being all, being that this guy what he's been able to accomplish in his career uh, been to five Super Bowls, lost two to the Giants, won the won the rest. Um, so a three-time Super Bowl champ, uh, arguably one of the greatest quarterbacks to ever play the game, and to have a rookie autograph of this guy. Uh, I guess I would have to say that's my favorite card in the collection. Uh, so hope you guys enjoyed the cards. Um, Tommy Goff again. That's my video entry. Top five, really top ten. But you guys could uh, enjoy looking at those. Um, again, I guess I'll take number four in your uh, contest giveaway um, prize if I do so happen to be lucky enough to win that. Um, but yeah, I'll talk to you guys soon. Enjoy the vids.